Hi, I'm Scott with Hammer and Hand. We're going to take a look at our exterior shade system. Uh, these are Hella Shades AR63. Uh, when you order these shades, you get the, the shade, the motor, and the track. There's actually just two major components, then a bunch of small pieces and some clips. Uh, the system from the exterior, when you first see it, it looks complicated. It's a really simple system once you know all the features, and this is a common feature to see on a house in Europe. Um, when we order these things, all we do is we give them two dimensions. It's the overall dimension in our width right here, and then our overall dimension in the height. Pretty simple. And then they specify the stack height. Uh, we have windows of all different heights, so when this thing retracts, it needs uh, different heights to enable to retract up into its uh, housing. So um, with, that, with that information in hand, we go ahead and order the things. They come in, and we've already had a uh, local, supply, local manufacturer make these beautiful little um, uh, steel surrounds. So it's 24 gauge sheet metal that we've uh, painted on site. And we had all these features built into it. This was in the architectural design, and we just did some shop drawings and had them build everything. But it's essentially handmade. And the housing that this whole thing sits into uh, we adjusted the height of the housing so that when the shade is all retracted, it just fits in there nice and neat. Um, one of the other challenges on the project is uh, getting power out to these things. And what they have is a, it's a line voltage, and it, uh, it goes all the way back to the mechanical space into a junction box. And then our outlets, our switches, are uh, radio frequency. And they, they go back to this uh, junction box and then tell these shades to turn on or off. Um, the, uh, the way we ran our power is uh, instead of just running the cable through the sheathing and then sealing that, we decided to do something that could possibly maintain the, in the long term. And we ran a piece of one inch conduit through everything, air sealed on the outside, ran our Romex through, and then we air sealed the inside. And that way, if anything needs to be pulled apart, it's easily maintainable. Um, we're going to take a look at how these things go back and forth. You're able to roll this thing down, turn it on edge, adjust the fan to it, and roll it back up. So when the shades are retracted, uh, the bottom rail, which is weighted, it sits about a quarter inch off of our sill pan. And then you can see these little pins in here. They've got a little stop on the back. They just dry run back through this little, it's a plastic runner. Um, and it's kind of, a, kind of just a loose but clean fit. And uh, that's, that's how these guys stay in line.